Today's video topic is gene therapy. Gene therapy is an innovative approach to treating various diseases by the delivery of functional genes into the cells to replace missing or defective genes. Gene therapy has the potential to offer a cure for a range of conditions that are caused by genetic mutations or disorders. In recent years, advancements in the field of gene therapy have allowed us to treat complex diseases that were previously considered untreatable. How does gene therapy work? Gene therapy involves the delivery of therapeutic or working genes into a patient's cells to replace missing or broken genes. The delivery of these therapeutic genes can be achieved through various methods, including viral vector and non-viral vector methods. In viral vector gene therapy, a virus is used as a vehicle to transport therapeutic genes into the patient's cells. The virus is modified to not cause harm and to ensure that it specifically targets the affected cells. Once the therapeutic genes are delivered into the cells, they begin to produce the missing or defective protein. In non-viral vector gene therapy, the therapeutic genes are delivered into the cells without the use of a virus. This can be achieved through various methods, including the direct injection of the therapeutic genes into the cells, electroportation, and lipofection. Types of gene therapy. Gene therapy can be broadly categorized into two main types, in vivo gene therapy and ex vivo gene therapy. In vivo gene therapy refers to the direct delivery of therapeutic genes into the patient's cells while they are still inside the body. This type of gene therapy is commonly used to treat diseases that affect cells that are widely distributed throughout the body, such as blood cells or cells of the liver. Ex vivo gene therapy involves the removal of cells from the patient's body, then the working genes are introduced into these cells in a laboratory setting. Once the working genes have been introduced, the cells are then reintroduced into the patient's body. This type of gene therapy is commonly used to treat diseases that affect cells that are difficult to access, such as the cells of the bone marrow or the central nervous system. What can gene therapy treat? Gene therapy has the potential to treat a wide range of conditions, including inherited genetic disorders. These are diseases caused by mutations in an individual's genes that result in the production of non-functional or absent proteins. Gene therapy introduces functional genes into the patient's cells to replace the missing or defective genes. Examples include hemophilia, cystic fibrosis, and sickle cell anemia. Cancer. Cancer cells often have mutations in their DNA that cause them to grow and divide uncontrollably. Gene therapy introduces therapeutic genes into the cancer cells to stop their uncontrolled growth and division. Neurological disorders. Diseases that affect the nervous system, including conditions such as Parkinson's disease, Alzheimer's disease, and various types of genetic blindness. Cardiovascular diseases. Diseases that affect the heart and blood vessels, such as coronary artery disease and heart failure. Is gene therapy safe? Like any medical intervention, gene therapy carries some risks, including the possibility of harmful side effects. Some of the potential risks associated with gene therapy include immune reaction. The patient's immune system may recognize the therapeutic genes as foreign and attack them, leading to harmful side effects. Insertional mutagenesis. The therapeutic genes may integrate into the patient's DNA in a way that disrupts normal gene function, leading to harmful side effects. Off-target effects. The therapeutic genes may affect other genes besides the target gene, leading to harmful side effects. In conclusion, gene therapy offers a promising approach to treating complex diseases and improving the lives of patients around the world, but still more research is needed to fully understand its capabilities and limitations. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.